And that's right, I'm live here at uh, the Church Builders of Brunswick County in their warehouse where, like you guys just mentioned, they need uh, y'all's help as far as helping rebuild a veteran's home. They're doing that at the beginning of this new year, uh, January 9th and 10th. And tell us more about this project and how it got all started. We have Reverend Spencer here joining us. Thank you so much for joining us so early. Awesome, yes, and you guys, you have volunteers here already, which is so great. We've been having fun all morning. Yes, we have, and it's a pleasure to have you guys here. Oh, of course. So explain, you guys just got a grant from Home Depot Foundation, mm -hmm. and now you're using this to help rebuild a veteran's Right. We, we received a grant from Home Depot Foundation, and this is to help a disabled veteran here in Brunswick County, and we're going to be remodeling his kitchen and his bathroom, bring it up for him and make it a lot better. Oh, that is so fantastic. And you, you guys right now, they're bringing in some supplies. And one thing I want to note, they also have food here that they're setting up just um, so they, anyone who's hungry, you guys give them that as right, well. Right, right. And uh, we don't ask for anything in return. If uh, somebody comes in and they they've have a problem with no food or we give them whatever we have here. That is so great. This, this is such a wonderful group. You guys are small, but you're always looking to expand. Right. We're always willing to take volunteers that want to come in and help. It, depends, it doesn't depend on what kind of talent you have. Everybody has a talent to do something, and that's what we want to encourage people to do that. Oh, that is awesome. Well, thank you so much for that. And again, this project's going to take place on January 9th and 10th, Friday and Saturday from uh, 7 in the morning to 5 at night each day. Now, they need anybody. You don't have to be an expert in anything. You no, you don't. I'm not an expert. Uh, my wife will tell you, don't ever even put me anywhere near close to plumbing. So, <laughs> But uh, as long as you can hand, handle a hammer or nail anything, we'll, we'll have somebody there from Home Depot that's going to be supervising and showing everybody what to do. Oh, that is wonderful. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Reverend yeah. Spencer. You guys You're are doing welcome. a great thing, and hopefully you guys can get volunteers. They just need the hands because they're getting supplies in from Home Depot. It's coming in at a time, so they don't have a lot of supplies right now, but they're getting them in. You can see they're just setting up the warehouse room. This is where the supplies are going to be set up, and they're just getting their room ready for today since we're here so early in the morning. If you would like to volunteer, we have a number for you guys to call. You can see it on our screen here, or just head over to our website, WECT.com. It's on the home page. Just give them a call, and uh, they'll tell you exactly where they're the home is. It's going to be in Shalote and uh, how you can help out. But again, you don't have to be an expert. You can start the new year off right by helping someone in need this season. They just need some hands to help out at the project site. Reporting live here at uh, Church Builders here in Brunswick County. I'm going to send these back over to you guys in the studio. All right. Great way to start 2015 off there. It is.